A mock funeral procession through downtown Burlington. Let them kill the trees! Was this group's symbolic way of saying they don't want the trees to go. I love this park. I've done a lot of writing in this park. I found 20 bucks when I was nine years old over under that tree. Just last week, the Development Review Board approved a new design plan for City Hall Park. It includes removing many of its trees, trees that city officials have said don't have a long life ahead of them anyway. To pave over a third of the park and to cut down two-thirds of the trees is wrong. One of the reasons I like to go and sit in the park in the summertime is because of the shade. They're going to be eliminating the shade. Members of Keep the Park Green led the march from Church Street to City Hall Park, turning a lot of heads. Only in Burlington are you going to see a protest for trees. And eventually removing the ribbons they tied to targeted trees weeks ago. They say the city asked them to do so. This is a people's park. And the city needs to listen to the people who are saying this current plan is simply not acceptable. They want to work with the city council to come up with a new plan that everyone is happy with. Bring it back to the council. Let's have a resolution. Let's have a vote on whether this is the plan that the council wants. Department officials have said taking the trees down could keep others healthy. But for some in the community, it's these trees that showcase nature's beauty within the city. In Burlington, Helena Batapaglia, NBC5 News.